guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are having a great day. Today is going to be an awesome video. I'm going to be installing some universal gauge pods into my 2015 Subaru STI. Um, after I do the installation, I'm going to show you how to uh, calibrate the Innovate Motorsport uh, gauges to make sure your min and maximums are good. Um, follow along. All right, so I went with the universal uh, gauge pods here. It has a nice little hole in there. That's a decent size. Um, and this swi swivels, it goes back and forth and it rotates left and right. Um, this is made by Glow Shift right here. And then I'm gonna be using this cable. It comes supplied with your Innovate Motorsports gauges, whatever you buy. And um, my laptop does not have a serial cable. Uh, so I had to get a USB-A to a uh, serial adapter. Make sure that this is male because the supplied um, cable that comes for the Innovate Motorsports is a female, as you see right here. So right now I'm in the vehicle. I'm trying to see if I want to put the pods right here or on the window right here. the hole that I have right here is uh, it's definitely not big enough for this port this is to the uh, the plug that goes to the O2 sensor um, I'm gonna go into the garage draw out that hole a little bit bigger so this can fit not have any issues all right I drilled the hole to about three quarters of uh, an inch I uh, got the plug right through I'm actually gonna adjust the tightness of the swivel right here it actually turns left and right as well, 360, it goes back and forth. guys I got the, the the gauge pods mounted right now um, this isn't exactly where I'm gonna put it but this is just a temporary location for it because the ones I want to get go to the front and uh, they'll, they'll be nice right here so I can show you guys how to set your min and maxes in the computer and uh, show you guys how to do it so what you're gonna do is get the the plug that's associated with the the gauges that you got from innovate and then plug it into the side that says out right here you can see and uh, hook that up right there and then hook this up to your serial port which is right here all right now that I have it plugged in all right once you plug it into the laptop um, go to the innovate motorsports website you're gonna go to support and you're gonna download the logworks 3 file wait till it's finished downloading and you're going to open it where you had uh, saved the file destination. Once you open up your setup, uh, let it run through its course. Uh, mine's already installed so I'm going to just run through this really quick and then I'm going to cancel it towards the end here. After your setup is finalized, you're going to search for a program called LM Programmer. That's Lima Mic Programmer. Uh, once you open it up, uh, it should find your gauge. But what you're going to do is you're going to update firmware. You're going to go back to the website. You're going to search for the gauge that you have, minus the ECF-1 and the MTXD uh, Vacuum Boost slash uh, Shift Gauge. And then you're going to download the firmware for it. I'm going to start off with the vacuum and boost gauge. As you see, I've already downloaded it. Um, now we're going to up, 
update the firmware, click to one of these files. I downloaded three, but it doesn't matter which one you select. Hit OK, and you'll see that this is in program mode, and it's going to run through its course and let it run through until that bar stops. Now that the update of the firmware is completed, you can go through all of the parameters that you have for your specific gauge, uh, change whatever you need to. Um, for this stuff, I've already changed a few things, but you guys can go to town on whatever you decide to use. If I did have my shift gauge hooked up, you can change a bunch more parameters, but my main prerogative was just to make sure my minimal and maximum was set on the boost gauge. out the program this is going to uh, what it's going to look like it's going to set back to zero and then switch to the next gauge that you're going to be working on all right now i set my min and maxes and uh, everything's good um that's how you do it let's take a quick test drive and see if uh, the min and maxes actually work Uh, I hope you guys are having a great day, have a beautiful night, and peace.